the Matters fans web and we've just finished painting crossbones so I thought well I've got these colours out the next best one we can do with these colours is the Black Widow so let's get on with it shall we <laughs> now I just want to get the picture of Black Widow out so I can reference it um, just to be sure I know what I'm doing I'm getting the parts I need to paint right or as right as possible <coughs> so again we're shooting for all black so let's do a whole black now once again while I'm painting this I'm just going to shut up and play some music because this is the long boring bit. That is about it. Um, <laughs> not much else to do, to be honest. So, like that. Now, I'm going to have a different paint colour altogether in this. We're still going to go with Barbarian um, Flesh. On her face, so we'll get this done. There's a little bit of the uniform I haven't quite managed to catch, so I can go into that in a second. that done and so I'll just get this bit of uniform I need to get done there we go that should be enough There's a bit of flesh that I don't need to do, but I'll put that over there for a second. Next, this new colour, well, it's not a new colour, I've had it for a while, but I just found this again. Jokero Orange. Guess where this is going? <laughs> right, so there's not much of this. I'm just going to take it straight out of the pot. Just go straight over her. So I've got a damp brush. I'm going to apply this. Oh, this is going on quite thick. Even with my damp brush, I should have put it on a on the palette. 
Ah. Oh well. Oh, I know it's a base colour, but I'm surprised how thick it's going on, considering what kind of colour it is. Hmm. Well, there we are. I'm going to the brush, dry it off a little bit and go back into this colour and try and move some of the build up around. Yeah, that's fine. There we go. Now We are going to be looking for greys in this as well because she has greys, but I'm also going to use this. I'm just noticed my belt. In fact, no, I'm not going to use because it's a metal belt. So I'm going to use some of the rough iron for a belt. That's the one I like having for a base for metal. I know it's a metallic colour anyway, but I think it just gives a nice background colour. I don't tend to use it on its own. I either mix it with something if I'm going to use this, like with um, the grid on the Um, crossbones video. Ah, yeah, it's also a uh, um, little wrist shooter things she has. That's gold as well. <laughs> so just carefully paint. Yes, no. As usual with these videos, I'm not showing you how these should be painted. I'm showing you my interpretation of how they should be how they're painted. Because um, I firmly believe that once you've bought the minis and you want to paint them, that in your purchase of a mini. You, you get an artistic license. You're allowed to paint them any way you wish, within reason. Keep with the colour scheme, if it's a set colour scheme, but do your own interpretation of it. So, where something may be yellow, use gold. Nothing wrong with that. Unless, of course, it's material and it should be yellow. <laughs> well, there we are. Now I'm hoping it's not quite. The hair isn't done. Isn't quite right yet. But the straps here and the holster are grey. So what we'll do is we'll take some of the black and some of this core, which is the. Gorgon hide, Gorgon hide, sorry, which is this one, and we'll add enough to make a nice mid grey colour. That will do nicely, and we'll paint the holster. I 
on the strap switch as well. There we go. Anything else grey? Yeah, there's a strap on that leg as well. <coughs> but there's still some black that needs going here. Sometimes as you're painting black it doesn't cover as, just as well as you want it to. Now, and as I say, I need to put some more black into the onto the palette because it's just getting that little bit low. There we are. Oops. <coughs> but we're just trying to do a runner, so I'll get some more black out. Again, it's Abaddon black. what we've been using. We don't need a great deal of this this time. We just do need a certain amount of it. Okay so while we've done that we can get out our skin colour which once again is going to be where I can see it. Oh, we're done with it now. No. <laughs> Reichland Flesh Shade. Give it a bit of a shake. And this is going to go all over the flesh and her. that up now, wash my brush, and then we can go back into the Inky by Darkness, which is this colour. And we're going to use this, as we did last time, to highlight the black areas. a great amount to highlight with this money. It's quite a small-ish character or smallish mini to paint.
we can mix some more black, some more of this colour in and make it a little lighter this time. And add something the line of light things are the same colour. That should do the trick. Oh yeah. And And again, we can just keep going up, just go around this. We'll cut off when you know that we're getting to the stage where you can't see the belt from above. <laughs> that will do nicely. Um, I did miss a little bit. And yes, we're back into the rough iron. That's that, and now all I need to do for the clothing areas, of course, we haven't touched the skin or the hair yet. Um, I'm going to get some retributor armor, give it a good shake because these metallic paints can settle and split quite easily. Um, there we go. Let's see how that looks. That looks fine. So again using a damp brush, we'll come in here and we'll just go over using the side of the brush we'll go over the raised areas. Hopefully the non-raised areas will be hidden. I will just gently brush over the belt. There we go, that's that. Now flesh. Okay, so the flesh area is quite um quite dry now, so I can do this and the way she's actually posed is not giving us much to work on in the line of highlights. But as I say, this part is not a highlight stage. It's enhancing the What's we're looking for? It's enhancing the flesh tone shade. There we go. That's a bit of rye near a mouth. We could touch that up, sort that out later. The hair hasn't quite dried yet. But we can go into the We can carry on with the skin though.
tricky trying to get down here to get that's better I just need to add a little bit more wash to a mouth that won't hide the mistakes I've made there well not mistakes but the bits that I've not quite done right Now, oh, yeah. Oops, I went off camera there. There she is, my wife. Leaving this side of the face fairly dark because. Hers in the way, and she's got her head down. But here, she has a little bit brighter. Like that.